the Horn of Africa started 2020 amid clouds of desert locusts and is set to end the year the same way. With the UN's Food and Agriculture Organization warning that extensive breeding is giving rise to a new generation of the crop devouring pest. Despite what the FAO calls an unprecedented large scale response campaign, locusts have remained a persistent threat. Something Fatuma Abi Dalmer, a farmer in Ethiopia's Somali region, knows all too well. Her community has been invaded by the swarms three times this year. It has caused problems on our farm, and we couldn't produce the number of bags of barley that we used to harvest from the field. Now we have a problem in the family. What to give the kids and to the animals, because the remaining green leaves aren't enough for them, and there are no cereals for the kids. The FAO says more than 3.2 million acres of locust infestations have been treated since January and that control operations have prevented the loss of 800 million US dollars worth of cereal, enough to feed 18 million people a year. But unusually heavy rains have created the ideal conditions for extensive breedings and swarms are already forming and threatening to spread. For communities across the Horn of Africa, that means starting 2021 without enough food. In Ethiopia alone, the FAO estimates that nearly 13 million people will face acute food insecurity in the first half of the year.